Hey everybody, welcome to the vlog for Wednesday, wacky Wednesday, um, May 13th. This is likely the last vlog that you seniors are required to watch. You are invited to watch subsequent vlogs, but this is the last one for you. So um, I hope it's, it's everything you hope it will be. Um, I got to have Arturo's finally. Um, I had been waiting since Cinco de Mayo when we didn't get to have it, and I had been craving it, and oh, it's so good. If you haven't had Arturo's tacos, you just don't know what you're missing. They are so delicious. Um, thank you for your very thoughtful responses and just um, putting your opinion out there about the reopening of schools and society. I think it, it does really make a difference um, what you think. And I, I get the impression just in your responses to things that people aren't really talking to you about it. People aren't asking what your thoughts are, or your opinions. And I do care what you think about it because you are a huge part of the school reopening when it does happen. So um, I am amazed at the wide variety of thoughts and responses on that. Um, I would say about half of you say, it's really dangerous. We have to be super careful. Um, we probably aren't even going back in the fall. And if we do, it's going to be some crazy schedule or it's going to be, you know, very like wide distancing and masks and everything. And about half of you are like, this is crazy. We need to just open everything back up again. Um, and it's really, really hard to know what is actually true. Um, I applaud you for always questioning and always looking for the real information and not just trusting what people are telling you or putting on social media. Good for you. Um, this morning, Wednesday morning, um, I will be in that meeting for the reopening committee. And I mean, I have no idea what we'll necessarily talk about, but if there's anything that I can share with you about that, um, I'm happy to do that. Um, I have a question. I still don't understand how you seniors are going to graduate. And now I feel like too stupid to ask. Um, like it's supposed to be a drive in, drive up. So are like some people going in the gym or is like nobody going in the gym? Is it going to be like in the parking lot? Like, are you getting out of your cars? Is nobody getting out of their cars? Are certain people getting out of cars? I don't understand. I will be there if I'm allowed to be there. You know I will. And I will participate how I'm supposed to. But at this point, it is just completely unclear to me. Like, So if some of you seniors know like what that's about, will you like send me a quick email and be like, here's what's going on? Because like they're not communicating that well. And at this point, I just feel too dumb to even ask. So, okay. Um, Hey, in terms of the listening assignment that you did yesterday, I hope you enjoyed it. It's a little heavier than the listening that we've been doing lately, but so beautiful and just so peaceful. And um, I just felt like we kind of needed that. Um, so not very many of you got the similarities between the pieces, though. And so I thought I would just bring that up in case you were like, I can't figure out what you wanted me to put. Okay, the... Similarity between um, selection number one and selection number two is that they were both about stars. That's it. And then the, sim the big similarity between number one and number three is that they were both composed by Eric Essenvalds. Um, so the composer was the same on that one. A lot of you made like super complicated answers that were beautiful and wonderful and like way more than I was looking for. So. That's, that's what I was looking for. Um, today is Mima Palooza. Oh, first of all, you need to understand that the funniest memes are probably the ones that I would get in trouble for sharing. I'm sorry, I can't. I wish I could. They're really funny. Oh my goodness. And the ones I'm sharing are also potentially going to get me in trouble and are also really funny. Also, some of you went bonkers with this assignment and like 
did like 20 of them. So um, you'll, some of you will see more than one of yours in the presentation. But what you're gonna do is you're gonna go through the slideshow, they're numbered, and you're going to have like a piece of paper, a little notepad, whatever, and you're gonna jot down the numbers of the ones that you think are the funniest, and then you're gonna vote on the form. And then I'm gonna tally it up and I will let you know. I think I'm gonna pick um, first, second, and third place, and I'll have some kind of prize, which is yet to be determined. I don't know what kind of prize, but something. Something that will reward your effort. Anyway, I hope you enjoy them. I feel like this is just like a big Mrs. Murr's roast. Bless her. She's easy to make memes out of, I guess. I don't know. Um, I think you'll enjoy it. And you'll miss her. It'll make you miss her, I think. Um, <clears throat> so, a couple reminders before I sign off here. First of all, seniors. So many of you have sent in that form, have sent in your picture of you with the sign, have sent in some like senior pictures that you like, but some of you haven't. And I can't do a glowing, wonderful tribute of you on social media until you do that. And I know that like maybe some of you are like, I don't care about that. Your moms care. Your grandmas probably care. Like, they want that on there. They want to share it on their page. They want the little likes and loves and whatever. Do it for your moms, okay? Um, and then also, Pops concert stuff. I did email you um, just as a reminder that all that stuff is due on the 15th, which is coming up on Friday. Um, if you're going to need an extension, please let me know ahead of time. Like, it really helps me to plan it out. Otherwise, I can't plan for a premiere on YouTube. And I want to be able to, like, publicize the premiere of that concert so that we get a lot of people watching it all at once. Like, that's, that's my goal. But I can't publicize the premiere if I don't have, like, a good idea of when it's all going to be done. So um, please let me know. And if you're having tech issues, if, you, if the music isn't coming together, um, don't sit in silence. Like, please let me know that. Um... Yeah, today's real light on the actual music content, <laughs> sorry. Um, but hopefully you have an enjoyable time with the meme slideshow. Um, I've got a couple of jokes that my kids are telling and there is um, a, little, a little rap Dr. Seuss thing that I just find really funny because I've read that book personally so many times to my kids and I bet you've read it before too, so. Anyway, have a fantastic, wacky Wednesday. Um, I can't wait to see how the votes come in.